I'm James Fernley and I'm the founder and CEO of Nature's Laboratory. I've been involved in natural medicines for 40 years and I've set up a number of different companies, but Nature's Laboratory was set up in 2002. I first came into to contact with the University of, of Bradford something like 15 years ago. The company was relatively new at that point, and we're trying to make that big step from, if you like, folk medicine into evidence-based medicine. So I approached the university, and I was extraordinarily lucky to, to meet up with, with an Indian academic, Professor Anant Paradka, who brought with him an absolute wealth of experience and science about natural medicine from India. And he was prepared to work with us, a small company with a small budget to explore and develop uh, the unique opportunities that we had. The University of Bradford effectively has transformed our business because it has given us that, how can I put it, that legitimacy that comes from working on specific uh, research projects that have specific peer review outcomes. The University of Bradford has delivered so many different resources, including sort of product development, intellectual property, which we share, but more than anything, they've, they've provided us with a creative partner that is able to develop natural medicine as an evidence-based medicine. Uh, Bradford has also provided two knowledge transfer partnerships that we've been involved in over this last 15 years. And those people are, are now running our laboratory facility. But there's a wider benefit. And that benefit comes from, from academics who are willing and prepared to think what it is like to be in business, what it is like to have to develop products, what it is like to, to sit in the, if you like, the commercial chair and view the projects from a commercial point of view. I think for most, for many small businesses, they look upon the universities as a sort of ivory tower who are not really interested in that kind of interface between, between uh, business and, and academia. They're interested in their own research. Things have changed and they've certainly changed at Bradford. Uh, so if, you, if you've got any thought that you think that needs that kind of research input, my advice to small companies would be give them a call. I'm sure you'll find a very positive response. This is the new world of business and this is the new world of universities. <laughs>